then we will bring back Benduk to the residents of Benduk by making sure that we put up a clean, capable leadership. Venani says his party has outlined strategies to address land prices and plans to introduce water meters to counter tariff payments done on estimated cost. The DTA leader accused the Ventuk City Council of dubious sale of land and other municipal services to some residents who can afford to buy it at market-related prices. Venani promised a never-before-seen campaign for Comas region to ensure that the DTA take over the management of city of Ventuk. We shall address the backlog of heavens in Ventuk. Ask the land of Oshitenda, Okahanjapa, all these areas shall receive urgent attention for people to be prioritized for them to be, get, to be getting land. Our land priority shall not go only to the young, it shall go to the poor. Whoever is poor in Vindu shall be accorded the opportunity to access land in this country. The official opposition leader did also not mince his words over the demand to put on hold the construction of a new parliament building estimated to cost about $700 million, saying the money can be made available to address the plight of the poor. The party had put a total of 15 candidates for local authority elections in Ventuk, which include Reginald Dirhad, Emmanuel Aukhamoub and Sylvester Gadapoa. Currently, the DTA does not have a councillor serving on the Ventuk City Council. Blanche Corises, NBC News, Ventuk.